Welcome back to another edition of Trial by Fire. Today I'm going to be trying something not technically spicy, unless I decide to change out your nose, but a little off uh, for some people. I am going to be trying the new Cheetos mac and cheese ketchup flavor. I love mac and cheese and I'm Canadian. We, we eat more uh, mac and cheese than anywhere else in the world. Um, but I've never been one to put ketchup on my mac and cheese. I did do it as a child the odd time to see what it was like, but I was never a fan of it. So to actually have mac and cheese with the ketchup built in is going to be interesting to see. Uh, typical mac and cheese bake, make milk, butter, or margarine, water. I personally don't use the butter. I just avoid using it if I can. But yeah, so this is going to be an interesting one. One of uh, a few new flavors that they have. So, I'm going to go make this, and we'll be right back. See you in a moment. And we're back with typical time to make mac and cheese. <laughs> so, this is got almost the same tinge as the Flaming Hot uh, Cheetos. I don't know if you guys can see the steam rising off this. It's literally fresh out of the pot. It's got... If you've ever had ketchup potato chips, typically most Canadians have, not really available in the U.S. or some other countries, so you might not know what I'm talking about, but it has that smell. Especially when I opened up the powder and poured it in, that's all I could smell was as if I'd opened up a bag of ketchup potato chips. It's... Definitely interesting. I used to eat a lot of ketchup potato chips as a kid. Kind of grew out of it. They're kind of not my thing anymore. But let's try the Cheetos ketchup mac and cheese and see how it is. If you enjoy this content, don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any new videos coming out. I'm not sure which way, whether I like that or not. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Like, it's not as pungent in the ketchup flavor. But there's also not a huge cheese flavor either, so that odd mix of cheese and ketchup. It's present, but it's not overly strong it's actually not bad <clears throat> would i go out of my way to buy it again probably not but it's not bad <laughs> it does remind me very much of ketchup chips so if you're american and you get a chance to try this and you've never had ketchup potato chips Now's your chance to kind of have that taste of what it's like. Now, it does vary when you have the chips, to which brand, uh, the type of uh, flavor. And they do like any chips. Like salt and vinegar for one brand is going to be the same as salt and vinegar for another, whatever kind of thing. It's actually not bad. <laughs> I, was, I was having doubts at how this was going to be. But it's not bad. They do have a few other flavors I, I picked up that I'm probably not going to do videos on, but they got a, a four cheese blend and there's a uh, another one I can't remember what it is, but then the usual jalapeno and the flaming hot, which are I've done videos on in the past, so I'll have links to those ones. They're pretty decent for box of mac and cheese. It 
this is your first time watching my videos. Thank you for coming and welcome. Hopefully you're enjoying an odd video. <laughs> Not typically my one normal ones. I used to like to try odd stuff. But you try odd things now and again. Don't forget to uh, do the subscribe and share and like and comment stuff and all the usual things. Because I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the summer. So I can go live and do some special videos for you guys watching. I want to thank the subscribers I have and hopefully you guys who are watching are going to subscribe as well because that would be great. I'd really appreciate that. If you have any ideas for any videos, then let me know. Always be interesting to try a few different things for that. I've done one uh, video that a subscriber suggested. I'd like to do some more if I can get a hold of them. Actually, pretty good. <laughs> it's growing on me. Not literally, but. <laughs> Well, I know you don't want to sit there and watch me eat a bowl of mac and cheese, so. Thanks for watching. I say enjoy the heat and stay spicy, but no, no real spice on this one. I'll talk to you next time, and enjoy.